be short. I'll be hitting it. Right. Lonnie's got something to show. I don't. I ain't got nothing to show. I'm capping. All I gotta say, 30 piece. 40 is 40. Jill is 40. Okay. It's 40? Yeah. yeah. 40. Sit. We play 40 together. Piece. 40 pieces. Hey. You keep pushing the ball off the floor. You have to push the ball. Let's go. Cal Squish over the years has kind of, you know, gone through some uh, ups and downs. Really, you know, been one of the most dominant programs in the Nike EYBL over the years. I do believe that over the past few years, we've struggled a little bit to be at the top of the EYBL and we're looking to get back there and having players like Juju Watkins and Jada Williams and players of that caliber, I believe is helping us create a bigger platform and um, being competitive again. I think it makes them special because they have never really played together and I feel like everybody's coming in like just, just fresh and new. I think sometimes when you play with a group that's played together for so long, it can be a little different. I think with this group it's just everybody is open to, you know, to direction and just trying something new and getting together um, and getting a great system together. Yes, it's all fresh. Three months ago is when I joined Cal Swish. I first joined a team um, not that long ago, probably a month ago after some complication with my other AAU team. Nothing too bad, but um, just God's plan led me here and I feel at home here. Uh, we all knew. I mean, we just got here a couple months ago. Some girls just got here a couple weeks ago. So, I mean, it's all new. And, and the fact that we were together and, and uh, persevering through a lot of things just says a lot about our team and our foundation, even though we only had a month to build it. <laughs> First of all, so basically, Judea. Juju got her own energy. Like when she's on, she's on. Like ain't no stopping Ju. We be like, oh yeah, Ju here. She showed up. That's my dog, right? We all bring the energy in our own way, but especially Jada and Success. Like they're always hyping us up. They're always keeping the positive energy, which is definitely something that's needed. I just play really passionate. Like I love the game. Uh, every game I leave my heart out there being on the floor just because I've dedicated my whole life to this now. And so it just, it means a lot to me to play the game that I love. Juju Watkins, Judea, she's the player that, she's an anomaly. I mean, she's the best player in the country in her class in 2023. And one of the best players I've ever seen or coached uh, personally. She's, uh, you know, one in a generational player for sure. Man, Juju's been my dog for a long, long time. We came up just playing against and with each other at camps and stuff. And she's number one player in the country. I, you wouldn't want to be on the team with anybody else, really. Jada's a unique player in the sense that she's really the glue and the cohesive part of the team. She's a, she's a leader off the court as well as on the court. Man, she brings great energy. She's a great person on, on and off the court. And I feel like she kind of uh, helps me, you know, be a better player and a better person. Lonnie, well, her, we call her Lonnie, but her real name is Nalani White. She's kind of like our dark horse. She's a kid that maybe people don't account for when they're focusing on Jada and Juju. And she's a kid that can step up and make some plays behind those two. Isabel Gomez, she comes in kind of as our, our trail guard. She's a shot maker. Her, her real strength is being able to knock down shots. Jessa is a 6'2 forward. She's really an in and out player. She's been doing a tremendous job for us defensively. Success is a small forward, about six foot tall. She's the one that comes in and just gives us a little bit off the bench and gives us some energy. We'll make some plays. She's kind of like our Dennis Rodman. That's what I tell her. Go out there and be Dennis Rodman. Brooke is kind of like our stretch four. We're able to spread the floor with her and then also be able to knock down that shot when we get her to the ball. Amama K, Oka, who's our 6'2", 6'3", with I haven't measured her, but she might have like close to a 6'8 wingspan. Caitlin is an off guard. She's a lefty shooter. She's out there to really just kind of spread the floor and knock down those opportunistic uh, three-point shots. Hey, hey, we passed the test, oh, y'all. I think the best part about being like part of this team gotta be the fact that we play with two USA players. Like, they, they legit. They, they, these are my dogs, you feel me? I can really say that I grew up with my dogs that's gonna be in the WNBA sometime, you feel me? Like, they doing big things and it's just helping me too. The fact that I'm able to grow with them, it's just, it's crazy, it's a blessing. 
What makes this team so special is that we all have the will to win. I mean, we have two USA players on our team and just having them being able to help all of us and help enhance our skills. So when you take the drive to win and all of our personal individual skills and put it together, it's really something special. Icy hot. It doesn't even smell like icy hot, that smells potent. You nasty. Ooh, that's icy hot. You nasty. Icy hot smells like that. Ooh, that's not icy hot. That's icy hot for real? Oh god. It's like the brand icy hot. Oh, the brand. It's not like icy hot. It's not like icy hot. Oh, it's <laughs> I want to make sure it's not broken before I sit on it. Just saying, bro. It's the only thing that's you. I saw Coach Davis and I went, don't do that. Oh, my God. <laughs> that's it. She said, I'm not going to make sure. He got it broken. He's scared. Don't do that. He said like it. Who's the funniest? Me. I don't care. Me. Actually, matter of fact, no. Because when me and Jada together, it's over. Bro, we are so funny together. I Like, we... That's the duo right there. Lonnie and Jada, when they get together, I mean, there's no stopping them. But then Juju's got like a really understated humor. The funniest, I don't know, everybody funny in their own way. Like, it's just like some people, like, it's funny, but they don't try to be funny. Like, a mama K, a mama K be cracking me up. She don't even be trying to be funny, but I think everyone like has their own little, little funny side to them. Me, I'm the funniest. I'm hands down the funniest teammate I don't know I saw Jada have her interview earlier talking about Lonnie was the funniest they all know I'm the funniest I'm literally the funniest person on this team and they can't say otherwise hey y'all so coming soon next year 17 no. oh, gonna be a move for real okay, I'm ready for my game recap for <laughs> me Oh, actually, no, Jada 2. Right. Jada 2. Success is pretty good. I can't dance, y'all. Y'all can see my little schmeeze, though. Let's see sneeze. She about to Let's see me sneeze. Like, <laughs> this thing's moving, yeah. but... Hey, 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 hey. I'm telling y'all, I can't dance. I'm being on there like... Like, uh-uh. You ready? Yeah. Guys, catch this, bro. Catch this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, never mind. Maybe not me. Maybe not me. <laughs>